zeros of a cubic polynomial table of values let's take a cubic polynomial y is equal to 4x minus x cubed we make a table of values for y is equal to 4x minus x cubed find the values of y corresponding to the given values of x key in your answers We now have the completed table. From the table, find the zeros of 4x minus x cubed. Key in the answers. Geometric meaning. We draw the graph of y is equal to 4x minus x cubed using the table of values which we have developed. Observe the graph carefully. From the graph, find the points of intersection of the curve and the x-axis. Key in your answers. The graph of y is equal to 4x minus x cubed is a curve which intersects the x-axis at the points minus 2, 0, 0, 0 and 2, 0. From the table we know that the zeros of 4x minus x cubed are minus 2, 0 and 2. So the zeros of the cubic polynomial 4x minus x cubed are the x-coordinates of the points where the curve intersects the x-axis. Cubic polynomial Number of zeros Let us see some more graphs of cubic polynomials. The graph intersects the x-axis at three distinct points. The cubic polynomial has three zeros. The graph intersects the x-axis at two distinct points. The cubic polynomial has two zeros. The graph intersects the x-axis at one point. The cubic polynomial has one zero. We find that a cubic polynomial can have three distinct zeros or two distinct zeros or one zero. A cubic polynomial can have a maximum of three zeros. In general, a polynomial px of degree n has a maximum of n zeros. Relationship of zeros with coefficients Let px is equal to x cubed plus 2x squared minus 5x minus 6. The zeros of px are minus 3, minus 1 and 2. This can be verified by substituting the values of the zeros in px. We find p of minus 3. Key in the values.
P of minus 3 is equal to 0. We find P of minus 1. Key in the values. P of minus 1 is equal to 0. We find P of 2. Key in the values. P of 2 is equal to 0. The zeros of Px is equal to x cubed plus 2x squared minus 5x minus 6 are minus 3, minus 1 and 2. Find the sum of the zeros. Key in the answer. Find the product of the zeros. Key in the answer. Find the sum of the product of the zeros taken two at a time. Key in the values. In general, if alpha, beta and gamma are the three zeros of a cubic polynomial, ax cubed plus bx squared plus cx plus d, a not equal to zero. The sum of its zeros is equal to minus b by a. The product of its zeros is equal to minus d by a. The sum of the products of the zeros taken two at a time is equal to c by a.